If you want to significantly increase your household's water resilience and save money on your water bill, then consider a larger storage system and connecting your tank to your internal plumbing. Depending on the size of your household and the space that you have available on your property, you might choose a slimline or a standard water tank. Tank sizes vary wildly, but a capacity from around 3,000 to 20,000 litres would be the typical size range that you might consider. Check out our rainwater tank size calculator to get a better idea of the size of tank that's suitable for you. Be aware that connecting your tank to internal plumbing will require a building consent and it needs to be installed by a registered plumber. This is to ensure that the mains water network is not compromised through untreated water from your tank backflowing into the main pipe system. A resource consent may also be needed depending on where you want to position the tank on your property. This means that the whole system could cost between three and eight thousand dollars depending on the complexity of what you choose to set up. While this may be a significant investment, the benefits of connecting a water tank to your house for non-potable water uses will pay for itself over the years. Whichever system you choose, always ensure that your rainwater tank has an overflow connection so that any excess water goes back into your existing drainage point. And remember, if you do require a building or resource consent, and would like to understand more about the requirements, or if you need help completing your application, information is available on the Auckland Council website. Or you can also contact our dedicated rainwater tank inbox. Check out our other videos for more tips and information on choosing a rainwater tank that suits you.